Having a shirt made at Chavez is an almost zen-like experience. You'll need to allow hours to choose fabrics, buttons, collars, and cuffs. Plus, they take up to 18 separate measurements per shirt. That degree of personal attention is enough to make any old Joe feel like a candidate for the best dressed list. Chavez was founded 1838. The father of the founder was the curator to the wardrobe of Emperor Napoleon and the son established this business as the first shirt maker store. A true bespoke shirt means that there is fittings. So the process means there is measurements taken, a pattern drawn, a sample muslin cut, adjusted, pattern change, and then the shirts are produced. What's the strangest request you've ever had? We once had to make a, a shirt for a monkey for a photograph. We add about 1,600 new swatches every year. What makes us unique, first of all, is the immaculate lining of the patterns. It starts with the placket. As you can see, the pattern is lined on the axis of the button and then the pattern is matched on both sides. They placed their color, and the color is matched top and bottom. The neckband is matched top and bottom. The shoulder is matched, the cuff is matched, and the sleeve placket is matched. The second very important aspect, it's completely non-fused. You cannot make a beautiful product fused. It is not going to last. How many new ties would you introduce a year? A few thousands each year. And not only we do a lot of new patterns, but we try to make a lot of colors. We stand for colors. We use warp and weft effects, so we maximize the, the shine and the movement of the fabric. For example, we use a hidden color under the fabric to give it a special reflect. This is a specialty of Chavez. This is a technique which was used initially in the 16th century to make fabrics for the Pope in Lyon. This is using real silver yarn. So the silver is laminated around what we call in French a silk sole, a silk yarn, and we weave it this way. And we can produce these effects, which are metallic, but still silky. This is probably the oldest tradition in France. Isn't that sweet? That is a good expression of uh, the kind of relationship we have with our customers. This is, this is cute. There is a saying in, in Italian, you say that you, somebody is lucky if he's born with a shirt. It's about this. It's Somebody's about doubly lucky if he's born with a shell. That's the idea, exactly. Mm -hmm.